04 to 08 and a half with the four 12 volt batteries and then you have the big section right in the middle this is how you're going to want to bypass the charger so that you can take this charge port out or just not make sure that you don't use it anymore um, if you follow this thin black gray wire it's going to come here you want to unplug that just disconnect that this red wire this is going to go all the way back over to the other side and it's going to connect to the top of the solenoid you just want to use a half inch socket pull just this wire off and then put the nut back on so that all the other wires stay on the solenoid this gray uh, this black wire right here sorry is going to come through this connector you can disconnect that but normally it would go to right here and then this would go right here this goes over to the B minus terminal on the controller so what we want to do is we want to cut here and here and then on this wire that goes to the B negative side of the controller you can either cap it off or you can cut it down closer next to the terminal and then just tape it off or cap it off there <clears throat> and that takes care of that aspect now what you want to do on the wires coming out of the onboard computer is you're going to want to cut them on the onboard computer side so if the connector is still connected you're going to cut them on this side you want to cap all the wires off except for the blue and the white the blue and the white you're going to want to put those together and then just make sure that that stays connected and then this goes into the vehicle harness and you are bypassed and ready to go